Okay, come right in. I don't know if it'd be best to be a little bit over on this side. Okay, we're going to start by palpating for the epidural space. We're then going to insert the spinal needle. And typically, as you get it down to the pro. Okay, let's go ahead and just see. Maybe I am right there. Oh, now take a picture of that. Okay. <clears throat> Actually, aspirated down into the epidural space. We're going to now insert the catheter and it should go fairly easily. I'm getting resistance though. Leave it about there. So you can leave it between the third and the fourth mark. These catheters have little striations. Okay, now come out so you can see me doing this part. Yeah. This catheter has got a stylet in it. Okay, now come in so we can show this part. This is an adapter that goes onto the end of the epidural catheter. And then we simply fix it in place by pushing the black part together onto the blue part. Then we unscrew the cap. And we're going to place the filter which is a micropore filter and then we're going to place an injection cap Hello? onto I'm sorry, the end of the filter yeah. we're just going to set this here we're now going to put a little bit of triple antibiotic ointment at the level of the port. You don't want to put very much of it because it will prevent the um, patch from sticking. Then we're going to spray the area and a little bit of the hair with some adhesive called Vidrate. I believe that. I'm, just I'm always in trouble. Okay, so we're going to apply one sheet of material, Ioban. Okay, this looks Perfect.